I want to talk a little bit today about uh, atheism and atheists and a lot of the misconceptions and understanding really what it means to be an atheist. Um, it gets thrown around. A lot of people just think, oh, I'm an atheist. It means God's, it's not a reality. It's not a concept on this universe. It's not provable. It just, it doesn't exist. I'm an atheist. The, the concept isn't even in this world, so they just put it off. But really, when you look at the origins of the, wor of the word atheist, where it comes from, the history, um, it's quite clear, really, what atheism really is. And uh, just looking at the word, the word atheist comes from the word, the Greek word, atheos. And that simply means to deny God. And the definition of deny is to refuse to admit the truth or existence of something. And the secondary definition is refuse to give something requested or desired to someone. So, let me give you an example. If I, or if I offered you a grape soda and you denied that grape soda, in order for you to deny that grape soda, you would have first have to acknowledge that grape soda. So all atheism really is, is you denying the is existence of God. So what does that really mean? You're acknowledging that God's there, but you're simply denying the, f the truth, the faith. You're denying it. That's it. It's, r it's there, even as an atheist. You're acknowledging it, but you're just denying it. Simple as that. 